All right, here's the scoop. You're on Void Linux, and you want to use the Brave browser. The problem is, you go to the download Brave, and look at that. You got Debian, you got Fedora, you got OpenSUSE. Who uses OpenSUSE, man? You got Snap. I spoke too soon. Who uses Snap, man? Cringe. You, you want this on Void Linux. And if you're using Void Linux, you're probably not using Snap. Um, people got a few suggestions here, and one person suggested that the uh, package maintainers of Void Linux add Brave to the official repos, or at least the source packages, but they've, they've already decided here that they only want one Chromium-based browser, right? So, what do you do when, uh, what do you do when the official maintainers don't maintain a package for you? I'll show you. You do it yourself. Introducing this rep this repository right here. So this is actually um, a fork of another repo I, I, I found um, that has a Brave bin package in the, the Boyd Linux source repos. And all I did is I took this, made it my own repo, and I keep it, quite frankly, way more up-to-date than this person does. Because this, this build here is two months old, and this one here is 30 minutes old, so... I'm going to show you how to how to install Brave Browser through Void Linux source packages. So it's, 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 it's maintained by your package manager, and there's no weird, weird hackery going on, alright? So first order of business, you're going to need Git installed, which I already have here. And you're going to want to download, or git clone, these two repositories. Void, uh, void packages and brave bin. So you copy that, git clone URL. Now I've already recorded this video once, or sorry, I tried to and it turned out I hit the wrong button and didn't record, so on the bright side of things, I do not have to download this twice. So once you have the void packages repository cloned, change directory into it, and you're going to want to run xbp, uh, xbps source binary bootstrap and that's going to update your build directory or set up your build directory to get ready to compile and assemble packages. Now, as indicated by the fact that my package is uh, suffix with dash bin, we're actually not compiling anything, but we still need this set up to um, assemble our package because we're just using binary builds. We're not going to be compiling a whole web browser. Maybe I'll leave that as a exercise to the viewer to compile Brave from source. And when you're ready to come back to Sanity, just download the binary, man. What are you doing? All right, so now that we have um, our build our build environment set up, you want to copy copy the Brave bin folder into source package. So I have I have an eighty I have a sixty percent keyboard, and it's something that's hard to tell when I have the arrow keys on and when I have the uh, the backslash on or forward slash. So copy that. Don't think I did that right. Yep. And now what you want to do is you want to build this package. And to do that, it's xbpps source pkg then name of the package. Man, I hope I remember to update that sh sum. Yep, looks like it's working. So once this is done building, you'll then be able to just uh, install this package like a normal package in Void Linux. So I don't remember the exact syntax of the command because I use Xtools, but we just go here, little control F action. And you want to use the argument here repository to set our repo to like 
a local folder and then install the package name, which is brave dash bin again. So I want to be root for this. I'm just change directory back into it. I log in as root because I don't have sudo set up. I don't have my brain set up either. Brave bin. So the whole command is xpps install repository hoster bin packages brave bin. Yes, I'd like to install that. And there you go. You now have the Brave browser installed on your system. And if you want to update your installer Brave, here's what you do. First off, to get out of that. So first off, according to this um, this GitHub page here, I believe the command is binary update or update bootstrap. Yeah, bootstrap update. So what you want to do is bootstrap update. And I believe it's a combination of that git pull so you want to run xps source bootstrap update to update basically your build environment you're going to run git pull to get the latest templates and all that stuff of your uh, source packages but also you also want to git pull uh the brave bin folder repository because that's what's going to have your updates for brave inside of it and you're going to have to copy that you know He's going to copy that back over to uh, your source packages folder. I'm not going to do that. I actually wrote CD and not CP by accident. But you're going to want to do that every time or every so often to ensure that Brave's updated. Or if you have like an RSS feed set up to like tell you to update some Brave, that's probably when you should update the uh, repositories too. But... Yeah, that's how you that's how you, I install Brave on Void Linux. Uh, I'd recommend you do the same way because again, it doesn't use any hacky script or anything like that. It just uses the package manager and more or less the officially supported way of installing packages that like aren't on the official repos. So yeah, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments. But um yeah, I'll leave a link to this in the description. And everything else you need.